This video is powered by the pros at Pascal Air Plumbing and Electric. Arkansas owned, Arkansas operated. GoPascal.com. Come on, I'm curious how the, you feel like the team has responded since last week and uh, how, how, how practices have gone. Oh, man, uh, I think we responded well. Our practices have been high intensity. Uh, we've been getting coached pretty hard, you know. It's been a tough week, but uh, we definitely needed it for sure. What are your emotions going into this? Uh, it's your last first se last season opener for you. Uh, yeah. How do you feel going into it? Um, man, I feel pretty good going into it. Uh, excited for the season. I mean, this is what we train for all summer and prepare for all summer. So it's like the last go around for me. So I'm, I'm pretty excited for it for sure. Scotty? Yeah, Kamani, I guess just how would you gauge the readiness of this team to to start the new year? Like, where do you, do you guys feel like you're, you know, ready to to get after it? Yeah, most definitely. I think I think we're definitely ready to get after it. Um, I mean, after Texas, uh, we got to respond, you know what I mean? So I think uh, there's a lot of guys in there uh, that is just hungry, ready for the season to start, ready to get on this journey. And uh, I think we'll be ready to go for sure. Uh, Ronnie Brewer told me the other day that you guys went through a pretty long film session after the Texas game. Could you maybe detail that a little bit? Yeah, we, we watched the entire game. <laughs> like start to finish the entire game. We were probably in here for like three hours. So <laughs> it was a it was probably it was the longest film session I've had since I've been here by far. Probably doubled it, tripled it. So uh <laughs> it was a it was a, it was a day for sure. <laughs> The last thing for me, Eric said in the preseason that you guys are going into this year with a target on your back. And where do you feel like the guys understand that and are embracing it, or where where do you feel like they are with that? Yeah, I mean, I think uh, we understand it, and if any of the guys don't understand it, they'll learn real quick uh, what it means to have a target on your back in uh, college basketball. Um, you know, I've been on both sides of it, so uh, I understand it for sure. And uh, but I think uh, we're ready for it. It's a challenge, but I think we're gonna, we're going to handle it well. Demetrius. Demetrius, yes, come on, after watching the film, uh, do you think it was more so uh, like a mental approach that, that led to the way y'all played in Texas, or or more so just the scheme that you guys uh, took to the game? Um, honestly, I mean, Texas is a, a pretty good team. They had a lot of older guys, a lot of veterans, their home and their environment. Um, honestly, I think, uh, it was just a mixture of our younger guys being young. Um, and then, you know, just as a team, we just didn't perform well. We didn't really shoot the ball well. Um, it was a couple of things that I guess you could chalk it up to, but, uh, of course, you know, we, we never want to lose like that and uh, we'll, we'll never lose like that again. So uh, I don't know what you want to chalk it up to. I guess it was just a bad night for us. Curtis. And Kamani, obviously you guys are still working through some things. You'll evolve over the course of the season, but just curious going into the opener, uh, what do you think this group can hang its hat on? I mean, is there an area of, of strength that you feel like this team has going into the year? Yeah, I think we just got to be the tougher team, honestly. Uh, we got to be a tough team, um, do all the stuff that coach wants us to do, do all the little things, and it'll lead to the big things. Um, we know right now uh, we haven't been shooting the ball well, but I think when we uh, defend well, and it'll just lead to open points, it'll lead to uh, us playing at a faster pace, and I think that's what we should hang our hat on, just be handling on defense and the offense is not coming. We got to be a great defensive team this year. And what have you made of North Dakota State so far and, and what you've seen from them and where they'll challenge you on Monday? Yeah, I mean, they're a pretty good team. Um, just like I said, uh, they can shoot the ball well. Like they, they shoot lights out. So like I said, we're going to have to defend the three. We're going to have to be a real good defensive team, tough team, get, get a lot of rebounds, offensive and defensive. And if we do that, we'll be fine. Hutch? Yeah, I just had a quick follow-up. Kamani, I think it was your redshirt year when Arkansas got beat by 30-plus at Alabama, and it was pretty intense yeah. practices and everything. Yeah, I remember that one. <laughs> has, has this week of practice been comparable to that, or how would it compare? You know, I know it was an exhibition game at Texas, so it's oh, a little bit for different. Sure. Oh, for sure. I remember that because uh, I was 
it was like my first couple practices and that's when Mus pulled out the weight vest and the bricks and I kind of had flashbacks because we, we've been seeing the weight vest in the in the bricks this week for sure so Mus don't like losing like that we don't like losing like that so you know he gonna get us right for sure and if, if you remember from that year it worked so <laughs> football is back, and Bet Online remains your number one source for all your football betting needs this season. You'll find the latest odds, matchup info, player news, and game trends. And as your continued source for all sports wagering info, Bet Online features live betting, free contests, live scores, and giveaways all season long. Always the fastest and easiest way to bet on all your favorite sports and events like MLB, MMA, tennis, boxing, and even golf. Head to betonline.ag to join and receive your 100% welcome bonus with your first deposit make sure to use the promo code believe to receive your rewards that's b-l-e-a-v bet online where the game starts